Hey guys, how are you? I don't have anything to show them. Just sit down. Can you get my bag back there? Um, so I'm going to tell you a little story, and then I'm going to show you what I got. I'm only doing this video because I'm on. I'm going to take a vacation because I have an attitude. <laughs> so we went to CVS because I watched um, Creative Chica Hall, K hey, Tony, um, and she had hauled the most darlingest CVS Hello Kitty stuff. Okay, well, we went to, I don't know if it was the second Hello, the, oh my gosh, the second CVS or, um, or not, they had the Hello Kitty, the little scene where she's got the tree, was it like her house or it was like, a like a little stand. farm thing? I don't know, like a little stand or something. Okay, so I was so excited. You talk about like a child. You know, finding a dollar on the ground or a quarter or whatever. Well, Eric goes to scan it. He comes back with that joker. And they and he told me that the price was $21.99. Okay, this thing has Christmas trees. It's got, um, you know, yes, Hello Kitty is pastel. But so then I said, well, that scanner thing must be broke. So I had him go over. Well, I asked him if he could go over and... Um, you know, ask him because I was still, you know, trying to look and trying to hurry and get home. So, um, because we're trying to work on the, you know, the basement. <clears throat> um, so he goes over and he scans it. I mean, he has the, the cashier scan it and she tells him, you know, $21.99. Uh, the thing won't work, you know, when you push the, um, the sensor thing. And that's why it's still sitting there. That's how people are around my around my way. Um, if if it doesn't like light up or, or beep or sing or you know whatever, people won't buy it. You know, I'm the person that will buy it and put new batteries in, and it will be you know ding and beep and you know sing and all that. So I have been, I have my, I've gone. We apparently have at least five CVSs, you know, in our in our area, and. Um, and none of them had any Hello Kitty. I mean, they have the Hello Kitty Valentine, yes. But they don't have that one, you know, like all the ornaments are gone. Almost every Christmas thing is gone because people around here are like vultures. You know, they'll want, they'll want to buy it before, you know, <clears throat> it's even on the shelf. So it was really pitiful. Okay, anyway, so I'm going to show you what I got. The This is both... Dollar Trees combined. I went in there looking for the pom-pom um, ribbon trim, whatever the heck it's called. I have one. I want more because I want to use it, you know. I told Eric, I don't know how to sew. So I want to get, you know, a few of them. So that way, when I glue it on a package, it looks like I sewed the Joker. But anyway, so this is at the second Dollar Tree. These are the owls that have the, the um, tea lights, and both of them have their tag and when you when you guys pull out these tags, you got to be careful because sometimes you guys think that they're broken, but really when you pull out the tag, it you know jiggles the battery. Which see here it must have done it because now the oh okay I was um but if you guys can see it, it's in there. Whoop. So that's gonna be so cute. So I got two. Yeah, when I went to move this, this whole thing is moving. So there's two in here. I got one for me and one for my friend because she loves owls. I didn't even realize that that's what these were was the tea light things until I was like, why is it double, you know, sided? Um, is this all I got in this Dollar Tree? Oh, okay. I was like, girlfriend charged me for two other things. Okay. So my friend was looking for this and I was so excited because I was like, hot dang, something that my Dollar Tree does have. I got her the Bannerific character banner. I couldn't remember if she wanted one or two, so I got her two. <laughs> and they also have the llama and, oh, wait a minute, the llama and the normal, 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 whatever the heck. So, isn't that cute? And then I got, where is it? Hmm interesting okay well I got wipies you know window wipies but I don't see them 
And then I remembered about this and this actually worked better because where I put that thing for my car, I mean, not my car, well, in my car for to hold my phone up, it lifts circles and I've been driving around with them circles. So when we finally put this on it, it worked, you know, a lot better, but I don't know. I don't know where he put the, um, so I need to take that in the house. Oh, they're down here. But these were nice too, don't get me wrong. So this, these are just, say, the glass wipes. You get 24 pieces. That's what they look like. They did a nice job. So that's all I got at the second store. Now at the first store, the smaller one, of course, somebody, somebody had hauled the glass cleaner, got me in trouble. Somebody hauled the glass the flowers okay so I got two of these these are just crazy but um they are the well they're calling them roses do they yeah I guess they kind of mimic or look like roses so I got the cream color but then at a distance you kind of think that they're white so I don't know they're creamy white we'll just say that so I got two of each and then I got two of these orangey red ones I don't know what color you call this because when they're hanging up all together, it looks orange. But now it looks more, you know, reddish salmon-y color. And then this is like a purple. Well, it is a purple. I guess with my sunglasses or whatever. I am just, I am just so pedoed. And then this is kind of like a hot pink. I'm wishing I got a third one, but I only got two of this one because I just really love this color. And I think having this bright color throughout here would really make it pop. And then I think the last one is the yellow color that I got. And then these are all my I did do some shopping yesterday and and yes, um the desk is still in my car. So there's all my other ones. Hopefully I got two of each one. Something bit my leg. Oh, dang it. I forgot to go get those um, little, I got those little mesh bags. I need to get Eric to look in his car because we have all the bags. I think we did. But my little organza bags, I think that's what they call them from the baby section. I got those in like the solid pink and then the, the white with the like pink trim or cord to put my pocket letter stuff in because I'm trying to get all fancy, you know. Um, but they're not in my bag. So I'm like, what? Hey, Batman. But anyway, I got these, uh, because people are putting their stuff in. It doesn't look like they're, you know, so big. I had bags that they were longer that I got from, um, you know, looking in people's trash. Well, we had a bulk pickup and I, you know, always talk about it, but they stopped it, um, where they would come like every three months or, or six months or whatever the heck it was. I think it was six months because three months I'd go crazy. Um, and you ride around the neighborhood and people would throw out like amazing stuff. Um, and so I found like a box of like, you know, unopened, um, like bags. They were like this, but they were longer. So, and then I went ahead and got, oh, I thought I got four of these. Did I? Apparently I only got three. Oh, look at that. One of my leaves. So these are the mall sheets. I got three of these for my fairy garden. And it said that my flower pots had shipped. So I was super excited. So I guess I'll have to go back to the Dollar Tree soon. You know, the ones that are the three sections. And then I got the, fo the fox moss stones, if you can see them. And then I was super excited to find the super bright um, 100, I don't know what looms, the desk lamps. These are the ones, well, you can find them out of the box. And then, so you're getting this little, I showed it in my other video, but, um, I think I did. Maybe I didn't. Let me take it out in case, because some videos I've been deleting and, you know, I'm back to doing that mess again, but they're basically like this and they, no, I don't think I showed you guys this, but, um, I have one in my room, so I'll have to look and see if I showed it or hold it. But these are amazing. They have, they take, um, I think it's three and there's no stupid screw. They take, uh, three double A batteries and I have alkaline batteries in mine, but these are amazing and you can move this up and down. So I got my, my, um, 
friend one. And then I got one for to for like a Father's Day gift. Because I just think it's amazing. And it's going to be so great down there in my um, scrapbooking. Now I can't get it back in the box. Look at this bag, y'all. It just like ripped to heck. Okay. So I have one more thing to show you and then I'm out. I'm out of here. But you know what? I'm not paying. Back to that Hello Kitty. I'm not paying $21. And the cashier was like, she's like, I'm sorry. She's like, I guess they're, um, I guess they're saying, I guess they're, you know what? You all flowers can just sit here and grow. Um, she's like, I guess they're just going to, you know, have it for, um, sell it for, or put it in the Valentine section. I don't know if I already said that. Here's my other two of those. I hope my friend's going to be excited to get one of these when I send her package. And then I got this cutie pie. I do not like, what do you call this? I do not like pumpkin pie, but I thought of my um, family member because he did. So I just figured that he was saying hi to me and this is just adorable. So had to have it. So that is it. And no, Bethy, I'm not, I'm not a liar. I really was not going to do a Dollar Tree haul. Eric was really um, baffled and shocked, but I just had to come on and rant about that stupid, um, you know, CVS thing. And I asked Eric, you know, because Eric was like talking about going to see a manager about it because he's like, well, this is totally Christmas. And him saying that being a man, you know, that means something. And, and so, you know, now that we're like, you know, just about, you know, home, I said, well, why didn't you like the whole time? He's like, you know, I should have you know, spoke to a manager and I was like, well, I don't even know if I want to pay $10 for it. You know, $10 to me is regular price. 11, I mean, um, $22. Well, $12 is them making a profit. $10 is a regular price. And then anything under that, you know, is amazing, you know, to get it for that price. But anyway, it just didn't work that way. He's going to McDonald's to get us some food. So even though I passed McDonald's, but I was just like, you know, I just want to get home under my knee. I really need to find out how to get insurance because under my knee is hurting like heck. My freaking tooth or my gum around my tooth it hurts like an abscess. I, I need to go to the damn dentist now. <laughs> so yeah, joy. But anyway, I'm just really worried. About, I'm more worried about my leg than I am my, my tooth, even though I don't know if I don't think it's my tooth. I think I have one of them things in there. I don't know what you call them. I don't know if they're called ulcers or when when my tooth got taken out, if now it's infected. But that's been a while. So I don't know. I don't know, y'all. And then it kind of hurts when I try to um, put the toothbrush back there. So I'm like really gentle and slow trying to do that. I just need to take my finger I guess, and put toothpaste on it and be like, Rrr. so I don't know. But anyway, um, so I guess that's it. Yep. I'm really, I'm really bummed because I never really get to go. I mean, it's, it's amazing if I go into a store and find something that I want and for me to go in this store and find it, like it was just sitting there like, here, Kim, here I am. And I can't have it. And it would go great with all my fairy garden stuff that I want to put in my room. You know, and I'm just like, and now I feel like CVS is like, no chick, you can't have it. So I had to leave it, you know, $22 is too much money, way too much money. I'd rather, you know, spend that money. Oh my gosh. I don't know. That just reminded me of something else. Oh, and then the seller on Etsy, I'm not shouting them out no more. I'm not, I'm not doing, if I order nothing, I'm not going to, I'm not talking about it. I, I messaged them once about because their their code didn't work okay they and a lot of I don't know I can't speak for a lot of people but my experience they don't tell you that you have to spend a certain amount of money you don't find that out until like I was putting all this stuff in my cart from them and um, then I found out you know after trial and error that the, the code was like, you have to spend, you know, $19.99 or 20 or whatever with before tax. Okay. Um, as a, you know, business person, you should specify, you know what I'm saying? 
You want to disagree with me? That's cool as heck. I don't even care. Everybody's got opinions. Um, but my thing is, you know, don't be posting it on Facebook and don't be putting it on Instagram and then saying, oh, use this code, you know, X, Y, Z, and you get, you know, 10% or 20%. Well, it's never really 20. It's always 10. Um, once in a blue moon, you might get 15, but if you blink, it'll be gone. And then, so then I never got, I never got a response, but yet I'm giving you my money, but I'm your customer and you're not responding back to me. Then, and I waited, this has been like probably a month and I, and I figured it out, you know, when I was putting everything in the cart to see, is there a certain amount? So I figured it out myself. Now there, so then I just put in an order a couple of days ago and then come to find out, then they added new stuff in the, well, they added a new item that I wanted, just one item. The shipping for this item is either going to be three something, well, close to four or close to $5 for one item. Okay. I've already paid you shipping for my other order. So I, I, I messaged them and asked them, Hey, can you, cause they'll, they'll customize an order well, however, whatever it's called that you can, um, what is it? I don't know what, what it's called, but if you mess it, a lot of sellers, you know, they'll add it to your order and they'll make it, you know, the sale just for you where you can buy and then they can do the free shipping. Okay. Well now they're whoever, I don't know if it's, I don't know, you know, what they are. Um, you know, meaning she's, he's, you know, whatever. I don't know the gender. Um, but I, that's why I keep saying the seller because a lot of people know, you know, sellers names and they know, you know, if it's a she or he, you know, or, you know, whatever. Um, so I'm just going to keep saying seller or I'll say they, but I have whoever I have not heard back from them since yesterday or the day before. And I know people are busy, but you know what, since it's been like, I don't know if it's been like a week or well, no more than a week since I heard from them, you know, about the other thing, I doubt that I'm going to hear about them. And then the stamp that I want is going to sell out probably because they only have like four. So, and then they don't have anything else new, you know, that I could waste, you know, three more, four more dollars. Like I have it to waste. Um, but anyway, so I, I just, you know, if they're watching this, then, you know, Here's some feedback from your customer. I mean, Etsy will tell you like, oh, try to talk to your, you know, the the um, seller first. It's like, well, how can you talk to them when they're like not talking to you? And I, I have never, I've only given like one and I didn't even make it three star. I made it four star because two packs of markers that I got did not work. Like they didn't want to work no matter what I did. And I told him about them, you know, and I guess, I don't know, but everything else, I always give five stars, whether I, you know, try my dyes out or whatever, everything, you know, I get, cause I like it, it gets five stars. So it's not like I'm a bad customer, you know, I mean, I've, I've, you know, paid their, you know, some of their living, you know, with the stuff that I bought. It's like, whatever. It just makes me mad. I'm just going to leave all this stuff in the car. So, yeah, i got to carry myself in the car. So maybe Eric can come and get it, but I don't know. I'm going to go in here and have a donut. I don't know what time it is. I think it was like 11 something. I got up. Um, I don't know what time I got up. Oh, that's right. My radio never turns on. Then, then my car is telling me. Oh, now my radio is coming on. Oh, no, it's 1230 now. Well, close to 1230. So anyway, guys, that's it. That's all she wrote. I'm going to get off of here and um, I feel like I'm going to start hacking. I hate when you get like a tickle or something in your throat and then you just keep coughing and coughing and coughing. <clears throat> Dang, them birds like wiped out that bird feeder. Oh my heck. Okay, I just can't see right. I'm like the whole top of my bird feeder is gone, but it's still there. I haven't hung up my other one yet. I might hang it in this tree. That'd be cool. See, I talk to you guys and I get an idea. You know, that new, um, the new one that I bought, the, um, copper one from, uh, Goodwill. So anyway, I got to go in here and wash, wash my hair because this hat has drove me insane. I felt like a horse with blinders on, 
y'all would have laughed at me shopping because I kept doing this number like I did with my bifocals. I'm like, oh my gosh. I don't know why it was in my way, but anyway. So, I go in there, eat my donut, and then Eric will probably, you know, have my food by the time I get out the car because, you know, whatever. Um, so, happy Wednesday, y'all, and um, I guess I will see you whenever I see you. I do have... Where did we go yesterday? And I'm getting so mad that my videos are so long. But some people's videos are like 20 minutes and it seems like they're only five. I guess that's because I really, you know, like the person. And it then I get mad because I'm like, wait a minute, this was a 20 minute video that felt like it was five minutes. Um, what else? Or maybe you guys know what I can do about CVS. I'm hoping that Eric will go back and, you know, ask for a manager and talk to him and see if, you know, we can get it for you know, not 20 some dollars because I think it's cute and adorable. And, you know, I just need to have it in my, you know, with my stuff and who knows if they're going to have them, you know, next year, they might not. Um, they didn't even really have any cute stuff for Valentine's day, but, um, you know, that I saw at least what they were putting out. Um, and there was something else I was going to say, but I don't know what it was. Seriously, there was something I was going to say. Um, I just cut myself off. But anyway. So, happy Wednesday. I know I, I think I said that. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But um, I'll talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a blessed one. And thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing if you want. If not, that's cool. And um, I guess I'll see you. Oh, I know what it was. Uh, I was trying to figure out where I went yesterday. I might. I Well, I do. If I feel like showing it. I went to Ollie's yesterday. And we went to a couple Dollar Trees, but really did not find. I went for looking for the planner, for the weekly planner, you know, the, on the, it's the weekly planner. It's like a dry erase on one side and on the back, it's full magnetic. And to let you guys know, see, I'm glad I, I'm glad I, I'm glad it popped back into my head. To let you guys know, the seller on eBay, mm, excuse me, um, because I'm burping air, um, 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 they should make a song out of the word, um, be a slamming song. Uh, let's see the seller. I want to say her name is Mar Margarita or Maria something, something Maria, something magnetics or Maria magnetics or something like that. Um, but now when I, cause uh, some of you guys have asked me on, um, Instagram and if you're coming from here, my account is private because I've got all these sickos who must think because I'm fat, ugly, and, you know, whatever, that I'm stupid. And so all these men, well, when I saw the naked person, I'm like, okay. And then when I was like, I was like, no, thank you. I don't want that, you know, mess. Um, on, on my, uh, you know, my thing. So that's why I made my Instagram private. Um, but I don't, I don't want just anybody. I don't know. I just, I mean, it's like every day I've got all these crazy men who are fake. I know who they are. They're fake. They're scammers. They're whatever. Um, and I just get so mad because I'm like, oh, yay, somebody wants to be my friend, you know, on Instagram and then or whatever you want to call it. And then when I go to look, it's a stupid male. Okay, now some of them are cute. Don't get me wrong. Okay, but it's probably not even their picture. And just because you're cute, it doesn't mean you're getting on my Instagram. So just let me know that you're coming from here or whatever. And, you know, I'll add you because some people, I don't know. But anyway, so anyway, so yeah, I don't know how I went to Instagram with that. Oh, well, because people were asking me on Instagram about um, the, who the seller was for the magnetic sheets. But just to let you guys know, when I was buying them, they were 12 sheets for $14.77. Now the seller has changed it and I've been, I've been buying from them for a while, you know, at least a couple of years, maybe more than a couple of years. But anyway, does it matter, Kim? No. So, um, now they are 10 sheets. I was able to get them 10 sheets for, I found two listings, which is kind of weird. And I made sure each button that I clicked that the price didn't change. But I saw one of them that was like 10 sheets for $13.77. I think it was 77. It might be 13 and change. Then I saw one where it was 10 sheets for 12 and change or something like that. So I opted for that one because I don't want to spend, I don't want to get two sheets lesser. I know this is crazy. 
but two sheets lesser and then pay, you know, more money. You know what I'm saying? Like $10 for the sheet. I mean, $10, you know, a dollar per sheet, $10 and then $3 shipping. I feel like that's a dollar more. I know weird thinking, but that's how I roll. You know, I try to save each little penny, each little dime, each little nickel, you know, every kind of cent that I can save. So, okay, that's it. So that's all my updates because I didn't, you know, I didn't want you to be like, well, yo, Kim, you know, you're telling me they're 12 for this and now they're 10 for that. So that's why, you know, I'm glad I came in here and told you um, or remembered. So, you know, went on another tree branch. Uh, okay, so that's it. Eric will be pulling in here in a few minutes. He'll be like, dang, girl, are you still in the car? I'll be like, yep, I can't believe I've sat here and it's been a half an hour in the car talking to y'all. That's crazy. But anyway, I can't help it. You know, I'm trying to talk fast. I, you know, whatever. Maybe I'll just have to be like everybody else and have like two and three and four parts, you know, and make them all five or 10 minutes. I don't know. Just saying hi. That, that'll be five minutes. But anyways, so, all right, I'm going to go. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a blessed one. Bye.